I'm Oscar Wales. I've been in Peru volunteering with Makikita Kwai Kwai for about just over two months now. I'm on a gap year before going to university. There was about a six, seven, eight month gap before I came here when I didn't really practice my Spanish at all. So when I got here, my Spanish wasn't as good as it had been. So it was a bit of a shock at first. I hadn't I kept on telling myself that I'd prepare before I came here and I never did. But I arrived and I thought, you know what, I'll just hit the ground running and I've been fine so far. In the mornings, I'm primarily just a teacher. I teach two English classes, one with um, two kids called Jose and Angel, and afterwards I teach Brian English. Each class is about 45 minutes long and then um, Afterwards, I usually do about an hour, an hour and a half of painting. Brian is one of the orphans here, who is, he's one of the older ones, and he's also the one that's incredibly talented with in regards to painting, as you can see from the paintings behind me. Um, at the moment, we're painting a mural, um, which is a sort of surrealist Peruvian landscape that um, Brian designed, which has been a lot of fun. Like at first when I came here, they told me that you're gonna, you know, you're gonna be teaching art. But he is a lot better than I am. So he, it's more like he's teaching me. Mm -hmm. So I teach him Spanish, and then he teaches me art. <laughs> it's run by well, it's a government-run or orphanage by this government program called Inabif. Um, the guy who's primarily in charge of the volunteers is this guy called Gonzalo, who sort of you know tells us what to do as volunteers, what our responsibilities are, he takes care of us. And then um, there's probably around 30, 30 kids here, 30, 40. Um, I love sort of the teaching English part of it because a lot of them really, really want to learn and they're really excited by learning English. They want, you know, it comes to the end of the class and they want to carry on going, they don't want to stop. It's really, you know, it makes you feel good that you're teaching something that they really, really want to learn because they know how useful it can be in later life. Um, don't worry about being under pressure or being stressed. Everybody here is incredibly welcoming and, you know, the day before I started here I was quite nervous because I've never sort of taught before. I've got no experience with this sort of work. I was worried, you know, maybe the kids won't like me, maybe it'll be really difficult, maybe I'm going to hate it. But the kids here are lovely, they all want to learn, they all want to, you know, play with you, they all want to learn from you. And they all just, you know, primarily they just want to have fun whilst learning as well. And they all, you know, all in all it creates a really, really social, easy-going atmosphere mm -hmm. where you can teach them. And it's, yeah, it's great.